there's somebody who has birthday today. Can anybody guess whose birthday it is today? Yours? No, I don't think so. Yesterday. Who? I don't think it's Timony. Who is it? Who is it? Hers. Hallelujah's birthday. Yeah. So we're going to sing her happy birthday first. Huh? Who? Eminence? Emanice? Emanice, is this your birthday too? It was yesterday. Okay, so we have two birthdays then. Okay. We have Hallelujah and we also have Emily. Nice. Shall we sing Happy Birthday for them? Now, we're, we're, if, we're, if we're to give your attention and we're going to sing Happy Birthday, okay? First, we're going to sing Happy Birthday to Hallelujah and then we'll sing Happy Birthday to Emily, okay? Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, hallelujah, happy birthday to you, <laughs> welcome little Blanche. Welcome, little Blanche. Welcome, little Hallelujah. Welcome, little Blanche. Yay! <laughs> now it's Emily's turn. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Emily. Happy birthday to you. Welcome, little Blanche. Welcome, little Blanche. Welcome, little Emily. Welcome, little Blanche. Yeah. <laughs> now, you're going to give me your attention. I have something here to give you, and you're going to tell me what it is. So everybody gets one, okay, one, one page. There you go. That's, that's exactly that, yeah. Everybody gets one page, okay? One page. Give one, take one page and give it to the others. Here. Give it to the other people, yeah. Now take a look at these pictures, okay? I want you to I want you to take a look at these pictures. Yeah, you didn't get one here. Here, you get one here. And here's here's one for Matty. Did you get one? Well, Matty needs one, okay? Who can tell me what this is, by the way? Can anybody tell me what is it? A library. A library. Okay, that's extra? Fine. So this is a library? What do you do in a library? Tell me. You read books. Good. What else do you do in the library? Pick, pick up books? You mean borrow books? Okay, you borrow books. You read books and you borrow books. What else do you do? Okay, after you borrow... Now, you, got, you have to listen to me, okay? Can I have your attention? Let me have your attention, everybody's attention, okay? Look at me, and I want you to listen to what I'm saying, okay? So we go to the library to do what? To read books. What else do we do in the library? We borrow books, and we do what? We return books, right? And when we return them, how do we return them? We return them in good condition, right? They don't have to be messed up. Uh, they have to be in the condition that we got them. Okay. And we don't have to lose them, right? What happens if, if, if the book gets damaged or if it gets bad or if you lose it? What happens? You have to pay money. And you're not supposed to do that. The librarian is not happy, right? Okay. Hold on, Matty. When you read, you've got to be quiet, just like now, right? When you listen to me, what do you have to do? Be quiet. I like that. I like that. <laughs> now, you hear people in the church 
uh, saying something most of the time. You know what they say? They say everything we have belongs to God. Right? Now everything that God gives us, or everything that we have belongs to who? To God. But it's not just only the things that we have. Even our bodies belong to who? Our bodies also belong to God. Okay? So uh, God owns our, bill, uh, our bodies and he wants us to keep it and preserve it the way he wants us to keep it. Okay? So we must be, we must take care of our bodies what? <laughs> Joshua wants attention, I guess. <laughs> Joshua, turn this way. Turn this way, Joshua. You see, what's going to happen is because our bodies belong to God. Let me have that. <laughs> Joshua, you're going to listen to me, okay? Listen, all right? All right. You see, like, what I was saying to you was everything we have, we get it from God, right? Including our bodies. And you know what God wants? He one day he's going to ask us what we did with our bodies, okay? So what do we have to do? We have to take care of our bodies real nice. How do you take care of your bodies? Eat right, get enough rest, right? Get enough rest, eat right, and what else? Exercise, eat healthy. By doing that, what are you doing? You're taking care of your body. See, everything we have, including our bodies, belong to who? To God, to Jesus, that's right, okay? So what we have to do is we don't have to put in our bodies things that are not nice. We have to avoid things that are impure, things that are not nice, okay? All right? Now, sometimes if you eat junk food, what happens to your body? <laughs> I don't want to say that. <laughs> But it's not nice, right? So what, what do we have to do? We have to eat right. We have to exercise. We have to get enough rest. That way we take care of our bodies nice, like, right? Now, when I talk about impure things, not good things, what am I talking about? Okay? It's not just only our bodies that we take care of, but our mind and our spirit we have to take care of, right? So what we watch on TV what we read, what we hear, all of those things enter into us. And if they're bad things, what do they do? They make us act like bad people or say bad things. Okay? So what do we have to do? We have to be putting good things, right? God expects us to be pure people. Our bodies are the temple of the Holy Ghost. Okay? The temple of the Holy Spirit. So our, our minds have to be, yes, our bodies are the temple of the Holy Spirit. Our bodies are, okay? So because our bodies are the temple of the Holy Spirit, what we watch, what we hear, all of those things have to be what? Pure things, okay? We don't want junk inside us. So we're going to pray today so that God will help us to keep our bodies right. Yeah, why do, why do we have to keep our bodies right? Because it belongs to God. We won't get sick. Okay, that's good. But why do we have to keep our bodies nice? Because it belongs to God. And someday we will have to return it to God. And we don't want to return it as a damaged thing. Right? So let's pray so that God will help us to keep it pure. Let's bow our heads. Okay? Bow our heads and pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you this morning for your goodness and your love and your mercy. We thank you, Lord God, for all the good things that you give us and the body that we have. God, you live in our body. Your spirit lives in us. And because you live in us, Lord God, we are supposed to keep our bodies pure. And we want you, Lord God, to help us to keep it pure. We want your spirit, Lord God, to work in us. Help us to choose things that we watch, choose things that we read, so that we do not put impure things into our bodies. 
Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bless I will pray.